appreciate the opportunity to be here today. And uh, it is true, I am unopposed in the primary, and let me tell you, that is the way to do it. <laughs> I hope that I'm making life easy on you. I, um, I wanted to encourage everybody to get involved in these races and get behind these outstanding conservative candidates. Uh, in 1984, I worked in the campaign all summer long. I actually met my wife in that campaign. We've been married for 23 years and have three kids. And so you never know what a great opportunity a campaign could lead to. <laughs> if you have a wife already, there might be other opportunities for you in this year's election cycle. I wanted to talk a little bit about the work that I've done as a state rep. Uh, when I was elected, uh, I was elected as a conservative candidate and I was looking for a way to reverse the Trend, the dominant trend of the ever-expanding government, and so created a committee in the House called Downsizing State Government. And so we, since the formation of that, we've had bills go through the, through the legislative process and actually signed by the governor to eliminate old uh, statutes, uh, boards and commissions, councils, regulations that have lost their way, lost their purpose. Uh, this year, uh, actually with the help of Senator Lemke, we eliminated about 60 programs that had not been funded for a period or attached sunsets to programs. Uh, uh, one, two, or three year sunsets to programs. So we're just dipping our toe into an ocean of reversing this dominant trend. But when was the last time you ever heard of anybody re eliminating programs either at the federal or the state level? So. You might be wondering, what does this have to do with the treasurer's office? I think it has everything to do with the treasurer's office. The treasurer's office is a financial position, and in that office, what we need to do is take a look at some of our long-term budgeting and planning. We need to take a look at how our system of state government operates and restructure government. And I think we have a particular problem about pension reform that we need to address. The sooner we deal with that problem, the better off we're going to be. And there's really no argument that we have a, a problem of unfunded liabilities. And we do not want to have to raise taxes just to address the problem in the future. So I want you to, to encourage you to get involved in these campaigns. All these candidates are outstanding candidates. I hope you'll get involved in my campaign. We're known for having the best t-shirt design. <laughs> Rush is our man over here. Stand up, walk down the runway. He's, he has bumper stickers. He has, he has brochures, turn around, turn around. <laughs> Coal Patrol, my daughter actually did this for us. Uh, so get involved, I appreciate the opportunity to be here today. Thank you very much.